Sunday, April 272014, the Terra Cross had been vomiting for one week. And uh, I asked when was the heat period starting. It was only a few days ago. And uh, I was surprised because normally pyometra occurs later. But anyway, when the dog came in, there was no bloody discharge in the vagina. But today, as you can see in the other video, the discharge was a lot. And uh, the owner came and saw it. So the diagnosis is open pyometra. Now, the blood test taken yesterday, you can see that the values are extremely high, especially for the total white cell count, which is 1, 2, 4. Normally, anything over 17, let's say 20, or 30, or 50, will be considered high, but this was a record high of 1, 2, 4. And the neutral fuse is nearly 97%. As you can see, it's very, uh, it's almost nearly 100%. When the normal should be 60 to 70%. Now the absolute in green, absolute is 120. 120. When the normal, the absolute numbers are 3 to 11.5. Now we go and see the platelets. The platelets are low. This indicates that the blood is toxic. So that's why the platelets are lower than normal. At 103 compared to 200 to 500. And uh, in this dog, there is a condition called septicemia, where it has a lot of bacteria in the blood and lots of toxins produced by the bacteria. So the case is a septicemia case. But surprisingly, after two days of IV drips and dufolite antibiotics and uh, spasmogistic, the dog actually was very alert and active, as you can see in the video. And uh, it doesn't look she was sick at all. Now this is a 14-year-old dog female, she had breast tumours early on on one side and then now, last two days I saw it, the, the other side had breast tumours in a row as well. So overall, owner decided to take the dog back and, uh, and uh, the dog was given antibiotics and painkillers and has gone home as at 3.30pm Sunday, April 272014. Top Bio Singapore.